What's good YouTube? You're back on S Motorsports. Today I'm going to show you a trick how you can make your truck sound better for free. So like I said, one small trick to make your truck sound better for free. Who doesn't love free? So I found this trick out by kind of just doing some searching and this popped up and I didn't know this, but in these trucks with the active fuel management or the displacement on demand, they have a, a valve in the exhaust for when it basically goes into, uh, you know, four cylinder mode, just like the Camaros and stuff. Um, but this is controlled by a spring and it's not controlled by an electric actuator like the Camaros are. So it's solely relying on the back pressure or the flow of the exhaust to push it open, push past it, which is just, I mean, if you wanna kill power, let's just restrict the exhaust with a valve with a spring on it. I mean, it's just dumb. So we're going to hopefully fix that today with a quick and easy method to basically hold that valve open um, we're gonna do basically a cold, coldish start um, with the valve in the stock form, and then we're gonna do uh, basically hold the valve open and see what sound, you know, how it changes. And then I also want to try and get some video of the the valve basically working in its normal state as well. I'm gonna, you know, rev the rev the car. Maybe we can go for a quick drive before it gets too dark and see what that looks like as well. All right guys, so here's a shot of the valve. This is on the back side of the muffler. Um, and really, it's just held open by a spring. I guess it, it does, you know, it does move pretty easy. That's just right in the exhaust flow path. So I basically wanna tie this open so that exhaust can flow easy all the time. And we'll, we'll see if we can hear any sound difference as well. Okay guys, so like I took a video of just the valve at idle startup. The valve does move a decent amount even with revving it just at idle. So it is gonna open up a decent amount when you're fully on it out on the road. This mod is probably more for like idle sound and how it sounds just cruising around. Probably not so much when you're on it fully as the valve will open up. But let's get to it and see if there is any difference by just holding that valve open uh, all the time. I'm curious to see if we can hear a difference. All right guys, so what I'm gonna try using here, let's see, I have a number eight screw. All right guys, so what I'm gonna do is, so this is its normal state, and if I start up the truck, you can see that it quickly jumped to just a slight bit open, um, obviously with the exhaust flow. So I am going to, this is basically straight up and down is what I'm assuming. And this is going to turn, you know, if the valve is straight up and down, we're going to turn it 90 degrees like that. So the valve is, you know, uh, open. <laughs> so I'm gonna put a screw right through here and try and hold that open. But um, I need to pry this open just a little bit to fit my number eight screw in there. Um, I think I can just pry that tab open just a smidge and that'll allow me to get that through here. Doesn't take much. That's there. And we gotta turn it just a there. 
we also have to pry that guy open just a smidge too. And the best part about this is, it's fully re reversible. You want it quiet again? Just pop it out. That's about the right length. Maybe a little long. Trim that down a little bit or put a couple extra washers. I think we'll do that. We'll grab some extra washers. Well, there we go. Well, guys, there it is. Just put a number eight screw in there and that's holding the valve open all the time. So let's see if there's any sound difference. Let's start up the truck. It's still cold start. As you can see, it's muffler is still pretty cold. So it should be a good indication. If it's gonna sound a little better for free. Holy crap guys, I don't know if you could tell, but there was a definite note change by just opening that valve. It definitely sounds way deeper now. Obviously, a pretty easy free mod. So let me know in the comments if you guys are gonna do that same thing or if you've already done it or how you held open the valve. I think that uh, bolt and nut trick worked pretty good. So I'm gonna drive around like that and see if I get any droning in the V4 mode or anything to see if that has any effect. But otherwise, I think I like the new deeper tone. It's, it's definitely way deeper than it was before with the valve just operating normal. So I wanted to give you guys an update basically on what I think now, this is the next day. I've driven around a little bit with the free exhaust mod, which honestly, it's pretty damn awesome. Like for free, it's like I just added a little exhaust to my truck for free. I mean, for me, I need to keep it relatively quiet, like I said, with uh, the family. We do take this for hauling and uh, camping and stuff where we still want it quiet. Uh, do not want an exhaust when the kiddos are sleeping. So this is absolutely perfect as it just gives it a little bit of sound. Yeah, I mean, if you haven't done this, if I would have known about it sooner, I would have did it sooner. So definitely, uh, Make sure you do this if you haven't, because it's basically like, why not? It's free, just give it a try anyways. And if you don't like it, you can always remove it. All right, back to the video. Now, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure to do so as I'm gonna be hopefully doing some more Silverado content. If you found this video, if this is your first time finding the channel, make sure to check out my Camaro content as well, as that has got the same 6.2 liter engine as my uh, LTZ 2018 Silverado has. So make sure to check out that playlist as well. I'll put a link up here. But until next time guys, thanks for joining in. Let me know if you're gonna do this free mod though, because why not? It's free and it sounds good. So until next time guys, thanks for joining in. Peace.